Hey folks, it's Antar, and I've got a new RU battle for you today. Uh, my opponent is Hidden Rasta, who I met through the Smog on Battle Finder. As you can see, he's using Yon Mega. That's because this battle happened before the tier changes and before BL2 was announced, and Yon Mega was banned from RU. So this guy's actually running a pretty offensive team. Um, not like it's, and it's distasteful, but it's a pretty uh, hard-hitting team versus mo most of the teams that I've seen so far in RU, which are pretty stally. So anyway, I lead off with my Tachikoma just to, uh, you know, scout out, get off the Volt Switch. I'm going to switch out um, because I don't really think there's too much I can do against this uh, Gardevoir. I'm going to go ahead and send out Steelix, thinking I can take pretty much any hit from this guy, and I'm going to go ahead and set up my Solve Rocks this time. Because, you know, the key to this team really, the key, the key strategy to this team really is set up your entry hazards and then stall your opponent out. So yeah, my Stealth Rocks are up. Uh, I could go for the Dragon Tail, I guess, but seeing that focus, he's carrying Focus Blast, I don't want to risk it. I'm going to go ahead and call back and send out Tuesday my, um, <coughs> excuse me, my Quillfish. Uh, going to take that Focus Blast like it was nothing. Um, but then I realized this is really stupid because what kind of Gardevoir doesn't run Psychic, especially if it's an offensive Gardevoir. So yeah, I realized, yeah, Psychic's definitely coming, I'm gonna want to switch out. I go ahead and switch out to George III. My opponent actually goes for the Calm Mind on the switch, so yeah, I made a stupid play there. Um, and I'm really, I mean, this, my opponent is probably running the T-Bolt, but I'm thinking it's gonna have to be a pretty high um, attack in order to do a considerable amount of damage to my George III. So I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Scald here. Just hoping to get some residual damage. I get a crit, which, you know, bypasses my opponent's two calm mind boosts. My opponent's gonna go for the uh, Thunderbolt here, and that's gonna do well over half. And I'm like, oh crap. I'm gonna go for the Scald here, and that is gonna take him out because I get another crit. So two crits in a row, and otherwise I had no idea how I was gonna take out that Gardevoir. But my opponent said basically, yeah, it's okay, my Gardevoir is kind of a whore. <laughs> it's a guy, which is actually kind of funny. So now I get crunched by his Sharpedo. I'm pretty sure I was just leaving in George III to die because I was feeling bad. But uh, if I wasn't, then yeah, I don't think I could actually attack it anyway. I guess maybe I could have gone for the Thunder Wave. But anyway, my opponent now goes for the Protect just to get uh, Sharpedo's speed up even higher and is going to be able to outspeed my Tachigoma. He's going to go ahead and go for the Ice Fang here. And that's not enough to KO. I thought I could survive one, and indeed I do. I'm going to go ahead and go for the Leaf Storm, and that is going to take out his Sharpedo, which is great. So now I've taken out one of the huge offensive threats on his team. I've got Stealth Rocks up, so I'm not actually fearing his Yan Mega over much. So now uh, out comes Hitmonchan. I'm going to go ahead and call back and go out into my physical wall, my uh, EVO Light Tangela. It's going to take that Mach Punch like it was nothing. My opponent's going to go for the Fire Punch. I wasn't sure whether it was carrying the Fire Punch. I figured it probably was. Was that a crit? Yeah, that was definitely a crit. Um, and to, so, you know, at least he gets a little bit of the hacks back. I get off the Leech Seed, and I'm going to go ahead and have to call back my Gargan at this point. Gonna go ahead and send out Tuesday, gonna get off the Intimidate, which will be nice, and I'm thinking I can sponge the Fire Punch. Actually, he goes for the Ice Punch, which is just fine for me too, but he gets the Freeze Hacks. I'm like, are you serious? But that's okay. Uh, so this is a very, very hacksy battle, but so far the Hacks has been somewhat balanced, I guess. I mean, yeah, losing his Gardevoir, which is which had already gotten enough two Calm Mines, that was kind of lame. Anyway, I survived the Thunder Punch because he is at minus one thanks to my Intimidate, and I'm gonna go ahead and have to call out, uh, you know, fall out because, um, you know, I'm frozen. I'm hoping that I'm gonna be thought, but there's what a 20% chance of that happening. I'm gonna go ahead and go into Hatterack here, uh, predicting the Thunder Punch. So free switch for me. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Earthquake. I think. Yeah, he's down to practically no HP, and he does carry the um, Life Orb, so actually this is just going to be a waste of turn because he's going to die, and I'm not even going to get up to use my move. So that's okay. I really, I guess I could have switched into someone to take the Mach Punch and just Life Orb called him out, whatever. Out goes Rhyperior, and I'm thinking, okay, well, I'm, I'm a Steelix. I can probably take an Earthquake, right? Not so much, so I was actually really surprised there because I was going to hit him back with an Earthquake, but then again, thanks to Solid Rock, it wouldn't have actually done too much. So now I get a free switch into Gargon. He's going to go ahead and go for the Mega Horn. I'm actually amazed that he outspeeds me, but that, that's, that's actually pretty impressive. But yeah, I survived the hit, go for the Mega Drain, yeah, I survived with 12 HP, so that's really awesome. I'm going to go ahead and get back most of my HP with Giga Drain, which is an awesome move this gen. And so now my opponent's going to go ahead and send out Honchkrow. I don't know what Honchkrow's gonna do, so I'm gonna go ahead and stay in, let him Brave Bird me and kill me. 
just because I wanted the free switch into someone else. So yeah, so he gets the Moxie boost, so yeah, maybe it wasn't the best idea to leave him in the die. I'm gonna go ahead and send out Touchy Coma. I'm thinking, uh, hope, hopefully he's, you know, actually, I think I saw the life orb. No, that was other recoil. Anyway, I was hoping he wasn't scarfed, but it doesn't matter. I take him out, and that's excellent. So I am gonna have to pull back my Touchy Coma thanks to the fact that I used Volt Switch, but it's okay. Now my opponent's down to his last Pokemon, which is Yon Mega. And so now I've got Maybe out. Uh, my opponent's gonna go ahead and go for the Giga Drain. It does it less than a quarter, so I'm like, okay, I can probably wall this guy. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Heal Bell here just to uh, thaw out Tuesday. Not sure that that was the best move. Um, I really don't know, actually. So, my opponent's gonna go for the Air Slash, so I'm thinking just, please no flinch, please no flinch. And I get flinched, but it's okay, I've still got 200 HP left, more than 200 HP left, so that's, so I just need to stay in long enough to get off a Wish, get off a Toxic, and whatnot. So yeah, here I go for the Toxic, and now I'm gonna try to stall out this Yon Mega with Toxic Stall, and try to kill it with Toxic Stall. So yeah, uh, already I've gotten, what, I think in the three RU battles that I uploaded with, that I've uploaded with this team so far, not including this one, maybe he's gotten a kill in two of them. Uh, I'll have to check on that. But my that Audino, which is supposed to be just a cleric and a support Pokemon, is actually a bloodthirsty bastard. I mean, just look at this. So I get off a I get off a wish this turn, and so now it's game over. I'm gonna go ahead and protect stall the next turn, uh, and that's gonna be the end of Yan Mega. And so that's really crazy. I've gotten another kill with Yan uh, with um, maybe my Audino. <laughs> it's just hilarious that this thing has gotten a kill in pretty much every battle I've used it in. So. A uh, great game, Hidden Rasta. He was a really good sport. I urge you to check out his channel, although I don't remember right now whether he uploads. Um, yeah, so comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge, folks.